Well, here's the thing. I didn't think we would stand for it in March of 2020, but we did. People were scared. People were scared. Schools. They didn't know. People now we know. But I think the difference this the next time, if we can't get anything in the law, and apparently we can't because Capitol Hill Republicans aren't even, to my knowledge, I, don't, I haven't seen any bills advanced to seriously address this in emergency power reform. What we have to do, we can't sit back and hope that American spirit rises. What we should have done in March 2020, and I count myself guilty among this, we should have immediately pushed back loudly, publicly, organized, civil disobedience. That's what was needed, and that's what will be needed next time. Yes. We have to say no to social distancing, no to, to lockdowns, no to mask mandates, no to vaccine mandates, no to any public health restrictions that are not done through democracy. And this is the way we have to do it from day one. We can't just hope people rise up. We have to organize and be loud and stand up ourselves first.